Hello, this is Chrysalin from Cloud Adoption Solutions. Today, uh, I'd like to share one of the most common questions that I tend to get when it comes to Salesforce reporting, which is, where did the rest of my data go? Uh, so we're going to take a quick look at one of our demo reports. This is just a basic opportunities report. And we scroll all the way over, you'll see that this has a bit more text to it. And as we go down these rows, you'll see that this one right here appears to trail off and look incomplete. If we actually go to the account that has that description, you'll see that there is indeed some text at the bottom that didn't make it into the report. Now, how do we see that data? You click on the arrow here next to edit. You can export this report. If you choose formatted report, you will run into the same problem. It has the same limitations um, as you see here in the Salesforce report viewer, which is that it does not allow you to view past 255 characters. Once you hit that limit, you will need to uh, take this next step, which is exporting details only. It won't look as pretty as a formatted report when that one's exported. It won't have necessarily all of the groupings and filter settings, uh, but the data will be the same as you see in the builder and it will have past 255 characters. So let's export that. And this is what looks like exported. As you can see here, you do have all of the information in there. Um, now, why would you need to see past 255 characters? That seems to be a lot. Well, there's a lot of people that will put quite a bit of information when it comes to scope or just account notes, conversation notes, um, and they may want to see this in their reporting. And as I said, the groupings and everything aren't here, so you would need to recreate whatever you need um, in Excel. Uh, and apply the filters here. So that looks a little bit more uh, like what you see in Salesforce. But that is how you see the missing data that trails off in your Salesforce report viewer. So this was a quick one today. Thanks for watching today. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to our channel for Salesforce related tips and tricks. Again, we are Cloud Adoption Solutions. Please feel free to reach out to us for any of your Salesforce needs.